Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. My name is Hannah. And in today's video, we are doing another Target styling video, but using all fall decor. So if this is something you're interested in watching, just keep on watching. But if you haven't yet already, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. You know to hit that bell button for every time I upload a video. And if you're not already following me on Instagram, I would love to have you over at Hannah Naylor. Without further ado, let's get into this. So this is my third time now doing these types of videos. And if you are just clicking on this video, what I do is I will go into Target and I have restyled some of their showroom displays. I'm utilizing 100% items from Target, from their furniture, their textiles, to their home decor, essentially putting a couple vignettes together, utilizing their product. And I thought it would be fun to bring you guys a fall edition because we are in fall. They just had a huge release from the Hearth and Hand collection as well as Threshold. And I know a lot of creators have done like Shop With Me's showcasing the new product, but nobody is showing how to style with the product. So instead of showcasing what has already been done, I wanted to bring you guys a video that could spark some inspiration if you've already picked up some of these items, ways to put it together, ways to make it make sense. So I have done a few different color schemes within this video. I also did not time lapse it like I usually do. I essentially styled, filmed what I did, styled, filmed what I did. So. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. It's probably going to be pretty short. But without further ado, let's get into this video. So I want to show you guys what the inventory is for this Target for their fall decor. This is their hearth and hand section. And then I will show you guys the Studio McGee threshold section, but not a ton compared to other videos I've seen of a lot of fall decor. So not a ton, but that way you guys can get an idea of what they have. All right, so here's the Studio McGee fall decor. There's not a ton. And as you guys can tell, it is very disorganized per usual of Target. But I just wanna show you guys what it is that they have and what it is that I have been working with. Lots of textiles. They've got a ton of textiles right now, pillows, blankets, and all sorts of stuff. Now as we get into the styles, some of the feedback was that the background was too busy and hard for people to focus on, so I tried my best to put together this kind of area in Target's showroom, grabbing a really oversized piece of artwork as well as I layered it with an arched mirror. That way you guys could focus on the styles itself rather than the background and sides being distracting. I really tried my best, but this was the first look really playing off of natural and earthier tones, bringing in that kind of rust brown. I brought the magnolia leaf that plays off of the green, so this is a really simple look. At this point, I really started getting into the styling, so I ended up grabbing this marble accent table to kind of frame out these two accent chairs and styled that as well, but this is a very untraditional color palette for fall, really honing in on the kind of robin's egg blue accents as well as mixing it with the terracotta brown. I think this is really beautiful, it would be great for someone that is at a beach coastal style home, someone that you know loves that blue look, but this was a really pretty take on the fall and bringing in those natural elements while still popping in that robin's egg blue color.
This next theme is definitely our burgundies and our plum colors. I really love how this style came out. Now there are two takeaways with this particular style. One, I want you guys to really lean in on using a cooking book stand as a way to showcase your coffee table book. The second takeaway is leaning into using a wreath as a way to style your vignette as well. Just as you would layer in a framed piece of artwork, your wreath is another way to kind of bring in that visual interest, but it also brings in color, it brings in texture, and it also brings in movement because we are working with a circular shape. So this is these are two takeaways that I really wanted to stress to you guys on styling a sideboard style styling a entryway, and yes, again, I really just love how this whole style came about. Now this next style is not going to be for everybody. Target has this really amazing mustard color that they have through a variety of different decor elements from garland to these arrangements. Now I know it's a bold color, it's a very statement of a mustard. Now I thought instead of bringing an abundance of it, I wanted to kind of play off of bringing in some green. So that way I brought this wreath in that has the changing colors with a little bit of mustard in there. So I really played off of bringing in mustard, green, and some natural tones to kind of break up everything. But I really love how this style came about. And again, I know this isn't going to be for everybody, but this is just a way to just showcase the possibilities of different color palettes. Here is the last and final style of this video. This is my favorite style out of all of them. I don't know if it's because it's the same color palette that I decided to go with this year for my own home, but I just love how everything came about. Everything came together nicely. The colors play off really well. The wreath has a variety of different colors from the cream to the burgundy to the green. So I really tried incorporating all of those particular colors within this style and I just love how it looks. Sound off in the comments what your favorite style was. And yeah, that is the last and final style. enjoyed coming along with me to Target to style the newest decor items for fall. And I did get a request to do Hobby Lobby, which I am attempting to do. I don't know how I'm going to pull Hobby Lobby off, but that is going to be something that you guys can be on the lookout for. Again, this is going to be all fall related, but until next time, I love you so much and we will see you guys then. Peace. Mm -hmm.